China's goals in space are very ambitious. China is now the third nation to launch humans into space. China is the, operates its own space station. It's much smaller than the International Space Station. Uh, but China has successfully deployed uh, uh, Taikonauts to space and is building its, its next generation space station. Uh, Russia uh, is, is also very invested and interested in space and it's, it's an important part of, uh, has been an important part of the national identity. Russia has not been, be, become a major player in commercial space outside of launch and even its role in launch has diminished. Whereas China has focused on commercial space as an opportunity for growth. Uh, changing its uh, format and approach to, to economic participation in space uh, by having less of an oversight model and more of a market model with some very big differences uh, compared to what we might think of as a typical market model. Uh, and China is seeking to uh, build uh, capabilities in launch. In fact, China in 2011 conducted more launches than the U.S. for the first time. And in the next decade, in the last decade, China and the U.S. have been roughly neck and neck with China matching or uh, in a few years uh, beating the U.S. in terms of total number of launches. And when I say China and the U.S., I mean commercial operators, commercial launch providers in China and in the US as well as government programs. So uh, China also is seeking to participate in uh, the satellite industry, both the more conventional large satellite industry that we've uh, all lived with for the last several decades, as well as the emergent small satellite industry that's driving new kinds of telecom and remote sensing applications.